All right, the ninth annual E-Race is kicking off in Avon today. Nearly 1,000 people are going to walk, run, and bike for cancer research. Fox 61's Taylor DiCello has been live there all morning. She joins us now with the director of the entire event. Taylor? Hey, good morning, Margo. Yep, this is Andy Caputo, and he's the man responsible for raising nearly $1 million all for cancer research. Thank you for joining us. Oh, thank you. Thank you again for being here. This is, uh, we just sent off the 100 mile riders. We have about 200 cyclists just sent out on 100 miles, and probably have another 200 coming off to send off at the 50. Um, so, uh, numbers are looking good. Weather's looking good. Um, we're really happy. It's going to be a great day. What an amazing event. How did you guys get to this million dollar mark? You've been doing it for nine years now. Well, we've never had a monetary amount that we wanted to raise. I mean, our total goal since the beginning is to raise inspiration, um, to have people challenge themselves to something they haven't done before, to have them you know, stay aware of their bodies as far as being fit, and so that if they are challenged or if a family member is challenged with cancer, that they can deal with the, the things that face them, such as being able to get the right treatments that they need, such as they can get here at the cancer center. The last thing you want to do is if you come down with something like that is actually um, not be able to do the treatments because if you're unhealthy or not fit, um, that, that challenges what is out there for you. So that's kind of the background to it. And to give for us was to give back to the institutions that um, inspired my late wife, Allie, for her fight, Live Strong and the Cancer Center here. So the money part of it has always been a secondary ancillary part. We've never had a specific goal to get to with that. Uh, we don't have a goal of fundraising for our participants. Um, we feel fortunate that each year we seem to raise more than 100 or potentially $150,000. And um, so we just, we're just happy that it, it happens. So we don't have a goal for a certain amount, um, but we're really excited about when you hit that you know seven figure mark that sounds pretty exciting so maybe this year we'll be at that donating a million level um, since we already surpassed the collection of a million level so nice. it's been wonderful nice thank you so much Andy it's such an inspiring story here today there's a very positive vibe and it's hard to deal with that when you're dealing with something so tough as cancer but Andy really keeps it positive here and inspirational and a lot of people are out here riding for their loved ones today as well the 50 mile race is starting at eight o'clock and we'll be here live for the send-off for you. For now, I'm live in Avon. Taylor DiCello, Fox 61 News.